one down there. We say, hello, Thomas. This is what he loves. He loves this inner tube from the summer, and this is what he likes to do with it, play with it on the kitchen floor while watching Mickey. Working on his core, working on his Cirque du Soleil skills. Uh, good morning, welcome to a Saturday edition of the marathon. I am about to go run on my elliptical for a half an hour, listening to the tunes, wearing my T-Swift shirt. A very sweaty mare will be back with you shortly. How's the elliptical face? This one had fun. He was downstairs with me. So, I'm gonna go get myself like, you know, showered and ready for the day. Such a good workout, and it went up a level, so self high five. So we've come to this place called the Painted Chair. You see it? And it's like furniture and clothes and um, they employ adults with special needs and they refurbish the furniture so we're gonna see if they have a mirror for us. We got these two. Ready. I'm gonna say hi. It's like that was a long car ride. There's no food here. We're gonna eat next. But. And now we're back just quickly at the house um, I was talking to my aunt last night and I have this like jar of lentils because everyone says vegans are supposed to eat lentils because they're good for you, they're protein, they're fiber, whatever, but I've never used them. So we found a recipe this morning that is a lentil cauliflower stew for the slow cooker. So we've just come back, done all the chopping, added, and then we're gonna go out again while it cooks. I'll show you it right now. It's looking pretty dang good. I'm excited for it. Yeah, so now we're gonna go out again. And this, I will show you later on this evening when we have it for dinner. We're back, we found a mirror. Nothing at Winners, there was nothing at Home Sense the other day, and so we went to Walmart because I needed something else, and they had a pretty good option, which I bought. I'll show it to you. In case you're wondering if you missed the previous vlog, this is the mirror that I'm trying to replace. Because I don't really like it. I mean, it looks fine for decor, but I could never do like an outfit of the day in it. And this is what I have been doing. So this is why you see my outfits like this. <laughs> so I got this from Walmart. This mirror here, which looks like that. It's like a standalone, a see floor mirror with stand. So my aunt and I are gonna see if we can figure out how to either put it in my bedroom or my office, or maybe right here. We will see what we come up with. So here's the update. It's so hard to show a mirror in a video, but this is where I've put it for now. Let me just turn this light off. So you can kind of see that. This will be the OOTD for now, just to see what we think. And I moved this over a bit, kind of restyled it, moved those, got rid of Thomas's little Ikea chair, which is here, because he never, ever, ever uses it. So I might put it in his room or just donate it, I'm not sure. But what my aunt and I realized is, I started to not like this stand, which isn't great, but, to be honest with you, it's probably the heaviest piece of furniture in my house, like minus my fridge. <laughs> so I don't really wanna move it, but what she and I realized was this is like something I've never styled. It's just functional, like that's all Thomas's hearing equipment and the DVD player and the Apple TV is somewhere on there too. So I've just grabbed a bunch of stuff <laughs> from around my house and I'm gonna see if I can figure it out.
this is what it looks like now. Look how much nicer that looks. And honestly, like, this is from the thrift store. These, I think, were... I want to say like Walmart or the dollar store five years ago. Winners, this was a Christmas present. The dollar store, New York. That's a crystal. That count candles from the dollar store. So isn't it just so interesting? Like I had all that stuff in my house already. And it just feels like so much fresher and looks so much better now. Update on the slow cooker. It's 7.15 and it still has like an hour to go. So we had sandwiches for dinner, fun fact. And now I'm making chocolate chip cookies. This is the um, homemade dough that I made and then I just put it back in this container, obviously. Um, this is from IGA. You can also get a gluten-free option that's vegan and 10 out of 10 recommend. So they're just in the refrigerator section like with the yogurt and the um, milk and stuff. They are delicious. To the marathoner who got me this noise machine for Christmas, bless you, I am loving it. It's so good. Didn't end up eating any of that lentil cauliflower stew. It's just cooling in the slow cooker until tomorrow. Um, it's 9.30. And I'm going to sleep because the highway to get to the airport is closed. And it looks like it's going to be closed tomorrow. Fingers crossed it'll be open in the morning. There was a big rock slide. And so... Um, they're gonna do some blasting overnight and see if that fixes it. But if it doesn't, what should be an hour journey turns into a three hour journey each way, or three and a half. So I could be doing seven hours of driving tomorrow, but my aunt right now is on hold with the airline hoping to switch her flight to leave from the airport here instead of an hour away. So I said, I don't care either way, it'll be an adventure. I just put a thing in the Marathon or Facebook group asking for questions for her, so we'll do a and a if we have to drive for three hours, but I figured I best be going to bed in case I need to be well rested. So thanks for watching. Thanks up, subscribe, become a marathoner. Life's not a sprint, it's a marathon. And I'm loving my new mirror and my vibe I got going in my room. So um, I'll see you in the next one. Maybe a Q&A with my aunt. Who knows? Thanks for watching. Bye.